All right, what's up, guys? This is a video update uh, number five. I'm Eric McGray, Jason Griffiths, Jake Foden, Drew Sabatini. Yeah. So, um, yep, video update number five. Uh, we're gonna be having a lot more of these now. Right now on the pegs, we got oh, on inside scooters. I noticed that people were commenting, wondering what kind of metal they're made out of. If they're steel or they're aluminum, because it doesn't say. They're not metal, dude. They're plastic. Plastic. Ah, look at that. Perfect They're example. plastic. Plastic. Plastic pegs. All the... No ting, ting, ting. Just plastic. <laughs> Just <laughs> no, plastic. No ting, ting, ting. Just plastic. Yeah, so those are the white ones. Originally have those. And now we have black ones too. So, uh, yeah. Black is pretty sexy looking now. Next up is the brakes. Uh, everyone keeps asking. The new brakes, I just ordered them, and they're going to take a few weeks to get made. I don't make them myself anymore because they're a little complicated to make, and making them my personally by hand isn't as accurate as having machines make them, so now I have them made by machines, and yeah, so you that's why it's going to take a while. That's, that's the whole point behind this too, is pre-ordering. Because I don't make them personally anymore, they're going to cost a little bit more money. A lot of bit more money. <laughs> so, <laughs> and I don't really have that money. I have some, not all of it, so we need your help. need your guys' help. Everybody. Yes. Pre-order. Okay. That's what's going to help. The brakes are going to cost $28 to retail. So, if you wait until they're actually available, they're going to cost you 28 plus shipping. Or if you just go to a shop and buy them like in person, 28 By pre-ordering through us, you can get them for $19 and free stickers. <laughs> free stickers. Everybody so, loves stickers. $19 versus 28 So 19 28 That's a good, good difference. Um, free so stickers. Pre-order. And the satisfaction, can you satisfaction of knowing that you're going to be helping us get more parts out there. Anything you guys want to add to anything? Ryan Becker. I uh, love you. Yes. Yeah, shout get, out to get well Ryan. You need to get better soon, please. I am praying for you every night. Yes. Yeah, so for any of you out there who have seen his scooter check, who have seen him in other video updates, he's like the little kid. This, this is tall. Getting to see him in the camera. He's 17. He looks like he's 12. All right, let's get that out the way. Um, he's a gnarly rider, though. So good at riding. Super stylish. He actually took a pretty hard fall the other day at Woodward Skate Park, and he's got am he's got a concussion and amnesia. We actually went over to visit him to see how he was doing, and he kept he he didn't know any of us. Right. He only knows Jason by the name. He's just like I, I don't know Jason who this kid Jason me, is, but he just keeps on calling me. So let's uh his scooters with me. <laughs> let's pray that he you know gets his memory back and remembers who he is again. We we'll go over the improvements on the brake. The original brake was made from 304 stainless steel, 14 gauge thick, right here. New brake is, it's 40% thicker, and it's made of a 60% stronger material, so 40 plus 60 is 100%, you know, it's twice as strong. It's twice as strong <laughs> yeah, as the yeah, old brake. it'd be 200% strong. <coughs> twice as strong as the old brake. They come powder coated. Like in the beginning, they're only going to be black. We're going to have more colors coming out later on. Still can get them raw though, if you want. Integrated spacers. Mm, yes. Integrated spacers is a plus. You don't got to try and fiddle getting the spacers in there now. So, pretty much, you know, we'll make another little update and show you how everything goes together now. Because it's just like the brake with the integrated spacers. The wheel goes in between them. And the way the spacers are, it kind of clamps onto the wheel. And the whole assembly just slides right in. Pretty much sums it up. Yes. Yep. Now this will sum it up. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh commercial? yeah! And also, the um, <laughs> we're not gonna have the little M cut out on the brake anymore because uh, some people were complaining that it would cut their wheel. I had never seen it. Um, I don't think anyone around us has ever had that happen. But uh, some people were just worried about it cutting their wheel up and wearing it down. So we just got rid of it. Yeah. Now it's just a super solid, super dialed brake. And they're going to be available for Razor, Phoenix, Mad Gear, Blunt, and District. Well, uh, yeah. 
think that's it. So, have fun watching some of our throwaway clips. Late. Deuces. <laughs> Deuces. <laughs>